Good morning, fans of Privateer FX. Coming at you 10 March. It's non farm payroll day. Uh, equities on their knees. 3920. 100 handles from the highs yesterday. Uh, crude. 7493. Also heading down towards that crucial 70 70 dollar mark. Still, still four bucks away, but. Um, and then rates, 381, who would have guessed that? Market uh, got totally uh, kerfuffled. All the institutional guys are short 10 years. Obviously, if rates go to 380, 10 years go higher. Um, so they're getting playing for a little bit of pain here. Currencies are a little bit confusing here. Um, I guess they're playing more to the stock theme than the rates theme. So Aussie's lower, so dollar higher there. Um, gold, you would think gold would be higher here with rates like this, but um, gold sitting at uh, 31, 1831. Euro, again, you would think this would be higher uh, with rates here, but 106 capped it, and now we're back at 105.93. There's not a whole heck of a lot to do here. I mean, we could talk about yesterday, um, which was a good day for us. Uh, just playing these short-term ranges, long cable. We were short dollar yen, but then we picked it up down near the figure. Played the option expiries, but there's no real point in talking about yesterday. Let's just talk about today. We have Canadian unemployment and U.S. unemployment. If the U.S. unemployment comes in super weak now, it looks like dollar yen is the horse. Um, BOJ was not hawkish last night, as many expected, including ourselves. Um, you can see we were 105.88 um, all the way up to 106.97, and now right here in the middle. But if this non-farms comes in weak and rates uh, continue lower, uh, dollar yen is dollar yen is the horse. Uh, and if this is a strong one, um, we're probably going to buy some dollar Swiss just because of that is extended, right? So dollar Swiss dropped 100 points yesterday, all the way down to 92.81. Euro Swiss went down to 98.40. Wow. Or before the low, uh, Euro Swiss is overextended here. We're at the bottom of the, the typical ranges here. 90, 98 on teams is surely going to hold today. If you can pick up some Euro Swiss uh, down near 98, right down near the 98 handle, there will be some money to be made there. Um, so dollar yen, if this is a weak one, dollar Swiss, if this is a strong one, you could also probably play dollar yen if it's a strong one, right? This is the one that's most sensitive to interest rates. Um, and it's just one of those days, right? You're just sitting here now. Um, you don't want to get too stuck into any dollar positions before non-farms because you can't really walk into that with a packet of dollars on short or long. So it's a good time to tidy up the trading journal, uh, think about how the week went, and you know, maybe get a little bit of a light exercise so you're ready and fresh, uh, ready to go for 2.30 uh, Central European time, 8.30 a.m. New York time, the big non-farm payrolls for like the 1,000th time in my career. Anyway, that's all I got today. It's a pretty binary day, not my favorite of days, uh, but let's just see. Let's just see what happens. Good luck out there, people, and have a good weekend. I will talk to you on Monday.